Music lessons. You know, that idea has pretty much disappeared. It's piano lessons, clarinet lessons, violin lessons, learning to master an instrument, learning to play, whoops, that word play, I'm afraid, has really disappeared. It's not play anymore, it's work. This is not necessarily helpful to your musical experience. This should be giving you pleasure. Even the figuring out of how to do it all should be a pleasurable experience for you to function at your best. But we feel so frustrated. It's like we'll never get it. Yes, that's exactly the same way I feel. And when my boyfriend became frustrated, check out what he did to his family's piano. His mom grounded him for a month. I don't want to do it. These feelings do not help. Frustration does not help. In fact, it causes a lot of problems. Reading has nothing to do with playing the piano. It's a different process entirely. Historically, people did not learn music by reading music. They learned by rote because music, printed music just was not available. So that in some ways was better because they were focused on learning how to play the harpsichord or the piano. There are many, many levels that we could discuss here. We can discuss the C major scale or we can discuss the position of the hand on the keyboard. Do you know the names of the lines and spaces? Quickly, I and mean, you can identify them immediately, what they're called. This isn't necessarily a requirement for reading it helps, but do you know intervals? Do you know that one line to the next line is a third? Or one space to the next space, up or down, is a third? Do you know what that means physically to your hand and to the keyboard? If you can identify a third as being that, you know exactly how to place your hand. You don't have to know, if, you've, if you're in a good starting position, you don't have to even know the names of the notes. You know up a third, ah, that's a skip of one note. That's a skip of one key. That's a skip of one finger. That's all you have to do. If you see a space to the next space up, to the next space up, three notes. Do you see that that's one, three, five, a triad, a chord? All you need is one finger of it, and then you put the others around it, up or down. These kinds of things are helpful. Do you improvise at all? Do you sit down there before you have your big operation of what you're going to get today? and play one note and listen to it for a while. Keep cool. Enjoy being at your instrument. Become one with your instrument. You can make instant music on your instrument. You just have to play very little and listen a lot.